Hi guys, uh, today I am here to tell you how to export a recorded video from your D2H. I have this connection video on D2H 3D Full HD. So how to export a video from this? You need to uh, take the hard disk out of this uh, box, D2H setup box. Okay, so for this I am going to open it because I have already opened it uh, so not screwed it back so this is a hard disk so which we need to take out first of all make sure that you have switched off the TV and the recorder DVR the setup box now carefully unplug it So the hard disk is out. Oh. So this is a Seagate hard disk. So now the thing we need to take care is uh, we cannot get the video out of this hard disk if we connect it via USB because uh, this hard disk is in a raw format. It is not a NTFS FAT32. So your PC it is not going to detect it if you are going to use the USB okay so now what I am going to do is I have a desktop I am going to open my desktop here is my desktop so I will connect it as a hard disk to the motherboard directly by using SATA ports of a hard disk of a motherboard connect this <coughs> so what I am going to do is uh, I will connect this hard disk by a SATA port to my desktop by opening the desktop I'll show you where to connect it and how <coughs> okay guys so I have opened my desktop a uh, CPU and you can see I've opened it uh, first uh, check the power supply should be off you can remove the power supply cable from here Okay, it's done. So see, uh, see I have two discs. Uh, one disc it's a primary disc. Uh, second is a secondary disc. So secondary hard disk we are going to use that. One we are going to uh, remove this secondary disc. This one is a secondary one. So I will we'll remove this. So this is a hard disk uh, from DVR. So I am going to connect with it. It's a little difficult. Okay. Disconnected. So the main hand hard disk on which operating system is installed, it should be connected, right? So okay, now it is connected. Now I am going to turn the power on. Okay. So so it's on now. It will take some time, uh, so I need to turn off the flash as well. I'm going to start it again, start the recording again. So you can see the PC now it's on, and uh, the hard disk it is connected where it should be. So now, see, uh, my system, uh, the operating system, it's uh, Windows 7 64 bit. So I'm going to show you. Here it is. It's uh, Windows 7 Ultimate 64 bit. Okay. So now at the hard disk is connected. You can see the hard disk capa capacity at 500 GB. So this one looks like this is the hard disk. 
which we have connected we will find these uh, one folder and two files open the default folder so here you can see all the recordings you have done okay so see for one recording there will be multiple files with same file name but the different extension so here this one uh, this has uh, 6 to 7 I'm going to this one so I'm going to select all these files and we'll copy it and so I have already copied uh, these here here it was the four you can see the file size this one it has 4 GB so it is a main video which you have recorded these files are the support files only and this file you can open and see so here it is working so there is one more problem actually if uh, the recording the size of the recording is more than 3.99 GB then it uh, is going to create the another file which uh, you will be will not be able to play it until we use the software that is called uh, TS splitter I'll give you the URL see this is a second file as you can see the main files GB it's low yeah so here yeah, the file size is 3.99 GB okay so that is why there is a second file the extension will be ts1 for the second file and the first file extension is .ts only okay now we need to connect these two combine these two files to make a one file so uh, we will download one software it is called ts separator which i have already downloaded and the url for this uh, ts splitter you can find here I'll post uh, uh, this URL under my video. Okay. So to combine these, uh, open the software. Uh, so go to setting and on a uh, file. In file, go uh, to open for joining. Okay. Add. So go to the folder so desktop. So this one is a folder. And this is the first file. Now this is not a file. Yeah, this one is a folder. Open this to first file. And now again add and go all files now select the another file whose extension is ts1 you can see here now click open and now see you can uh, select the destination here the path you can give here, where you want to store the combined file ok uh, so now start join Just going to take some time. <clears throat> oh, so it's done. So close it. Now I'll we'll open that folder where we have saved the joint file video. Okay, so you can see the file is here with the name joined.ts now the size of the file you can also see it will be more than uh, 3.99 GB so this uh, size is 
9 GB. So now your video is joined, it's out of the desktop, out of this uh, DBR. So here are the videos. And thanks for watching the video. Uh, like it and comment.